and we are live. Welcome back to West Ham United. This is another episode of Strikers Under Golden Sullivan Part 4. It's mad to think how many strikers we've had and we're going going through like a time walk through it. So now we're going to be starting at the last year at Upton Park and then the first year at London Stadium. Mike knows off the top of his head what amazing strikers we've had through the door and we're going to give our ratings out of, out of 10 for them. But most importantly, Mike, how are you doing? Yeah, good mate yourself. Yeah, not too bad, thank you, mate. Not too bad. Yeah, Do you know what? I'm getting over it slowly. Sunday. Yeah, gonna I, I was going to say little, that. Saturday's going to take me a bit of a while to get over, but, but it's gradually going, mate. Yeah. I'm looking forward to this winter break, though. It's like a winter break yeah. for YouTube as well, and like us, in, us in general. I'm, I'm, I actually am looking forward to not yeah. worrying about West Ham for a week. No, no worries, mate. Yeah, just have a few beers and chill. Yeah, yeah, no. So, Mike. So, obviously, I gave you a bit of an idea, but obviously, it's like came back memories. I've shared some some with the viewers as well. The likes of, um, I'm going to say one Jonathan Caleri is one of these strikers oh, who's who's who, who, who's on this list. But um, we'll get the ball rolling, mate. Um, actually, one second. Let's get the ball rolling. So, we have. First player who was signed under Slaven Bilic, which is Nikola Jelovic. Obviously, oh, we signed. Yeah, yeah, that's the one, mate. Obviously, oh, we signed. Yeah, I so we. <laughs> carry on, mate. You carry on. No, I was just going to say we signed him for a magnificent three million pound. Uh, he made fifteen appearances, two goals, and two assists. But the floor is your, Mike. What do you want to say? Well, I do remember the. I think it was against Wolven, Wolves in the FA Cup. Yeah. I was at that game and, um, yeah, I, do you know what? I thought, you know, this guy could score a few goals for us, you know, but it just didn't happen. <laughs> yeah, it again, really it didn't. didn't happen. It really didn't. It no. really didn't. Sorry, I've just realised I've got, if anyone is new around here and wondering what we're doing, so uh, I've got eight strikers, I think, what we're going to go through. Uh, me and Mike, we're going to talk about the memories. Anyone in the chat as well? More than welcome to say uh, your memories. And then at the end, we're going to give them a rating out of 10 um, of, of what impact they um done for us. But yeah, Mike, sorry. I, I agree with you, though. I, I thought when he come in, I was yeah. like, well, we've got a decent striker here. Like, to add with what we had with Sacco, Valencia and Carroll, I was like, we've got four strikers again. And the last real time we had that was Sheringham, Harewood, Zamora and Ashton, really, Ashton. when you had four strikers. Yeah, yeah. I know this guy was he was knocking him in for Everton. Was it Everton he came from? Uh, Hull. Hull, sorry. He came from Hull yeah. and he was he was scoring goals and I thought, oh, this guy he could do a job for us. And uh, yeah, I was there, I witnessed that one against Wolves, but he came on as sub a few times and uh, oh, I don't know, he just didn't look <laughs> just up didn't to click, it, mate. did it? Didn't happen. It just didn't happen for him. Yeah, but as you I can think see, he'd had his best days again, mate, didn't he? I think he's had his days. Yeah, I remember him mainly for um, when he was at Rangers, because obviously yeah, Everton, Rangers. Bought, uh, Everton bought him. Yeah. Then he yeah. went to Hull, I think. Correct yeah. me if I'm wrong. And then and then obviously we signed him. We uh, him. Let's have a look. Good evening, sir. Hope you're doing well. And we've got Kent. Kent's in it. See, I love it when Kent's in here. Kent's like an encyclopedia. He'll be. He'll, uh, uh, he'll help us out on this. Jelovic, another waste of dollar. Goal versus Wolves and Newcastle. <laughs> awful sign. Straight to the point. So, everyone in the chat, let's get ready. Mike, what rating are you going to give him um, cool. out of 10? 15 appearances, two 15 goals and two... Two goals, mate. It... <laughs> oh, it's tough, but I know I've been really harsh on a lot of strikers that we've done. <laughs> um, it doesn't get any better, mate. <laughs> no, I mean, it. mate... 15 appearances, two goals and two assists is not great, is it? You know, I'm going to be... Because I thought he looked a decent player, he scored a couple of decent goals for us, but it just he, his best days were behind him. And, yeah, I'm, yeah. I've got to agree with Ken Zorro. I was just about to say three. <laughs> yeah, yeah, honestly, it can't um, be any more than three. I'm sorry. Uh, my mum's getting involved as well, and we've got another James two as well. Two, yeah. two. That's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him a free. One for putting the, the shirt, well. one for putting the shirt on, and one point yeah. for each goal. <laughs> Fair enough. I can't right. give him any more than free. Mike, do you reckon it's gonna get better? Do you have any idea in the next I've one? Maybe. I've got a feeling this is gonna get worse. Right, are you ready for this, man? 
Mate. I mean, you, we can't even give him one for turning up, can we? <laughs> free Turn transfer. For training, probably. Fr- oh. Free transfer and left the club in February. He, was, he stayed with us for two years. Two years? Well, well 18 months. That, that 18 months. Eight make months no appearances, month, no goals and no assists. Do you even remember him? I remember the name. I do remember the name, yeah. It was like yeah. the other guy didn't make any appearances. Who was that? Yeah. Belich. Was it Belich or, Reb- Belich. or one Montene- of the ones? What? Montenegro? Uh... Oh, I know who you mean. But yeah. I think he's probably. I think he might be in this one actually. Is so. it? Oh dear. Well, well, sorry. Well, <laughs> sorry, mate. I won't. No, no, no. It's fine. No, no, it's fine, mate. It's fine. It just proves another yeah. striker. Um, I don't even think he was that prolific for the under twenty threes. No. I think uh, a high, a high, um, high expectation of, of him. And when you buy these youngsters, which we've got a couple more coming up, it, it you, apart from that, I don't really remember him <laughs> to be honest. The name just. Ticks a little bit, something of a bell, up, mate. But uh, yeah, 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 well, he must have turned up and put the shirt on someone, so we'll give him one for that. Yeah, that under 21s. That is he not yeah. under 21s? Here we go, straight to the point. Crap player, love it, <laughs> love it. <laughs> <laughs> well, really, we can't say that because we've never really seen him, have we? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, no wonder I don't remember him. And Kent yeah. saying one for putting putting the ink on the <laughs> wallet yeah. and what. Yes. You know what? Thanks, I'm going to give him a zero. I'm giving him yeah. a zero. Yeah. Nothing. Right. Okay. I've given him one for turning up for training. Okay. <laughs> right. Mike, do you reckon it can get better than this? Slightly. <laughs> right. Next one. Mikel Antonio. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so. What can you say about this guy, mate? I mean, that, you know. Yeah. You carry on and say your bit, but... Uh... Well, no, I'm just going to give everyone the uh, thing. So, obviously, he joined us in September 2015. Seven million transfer for Nottingham Forest. Uh, this is... Oh, wow. This is probably this before Man United. So, it's 277 appearances now for the yeah. club. Uh, 57 goals, 36 to 6. But then what I've done is, obviously, we didn't buy him as a striker. This is his centre-forward record, which is amazing. Yeah. He's 92 appearances, 30 goals and 16 assists yeah. as a centre-forward floor is yours, Mike. Take it away. Well, that's what we've got to remember is we signed this guy and, um, you know, he hadn't made it anywhere else. You know, we were giving him, I think, probably his last chance. It probably yeah. would have been one of his last chances. And especially in the Premier League. And as a right back, you know, as a, as a right wing back, I thought he was a good player and he scored a lot of goals. I remember he used to sneak in on that fire post with the old head and that again. Yeah. And Moyes has turned him into a striker. Yeah. And what can you say? His, his record as a striker for a guy who started out as a right back, I think so it's one in one in one in three, phenomenal. one in phenomenal. three, and one in three, yeah. and what's that? One uh, an assist every six. Is that right? I mean, the guy we all know what one you get four. from Mickey. He, you know, he looks a bit awkward at times. You know, he's he's really bulked up now, and he, I mean, he is. He's always been quite a big lad, but I think he's done something with he's He's got better sort of fitness. I don't think he's as... Yeah, it's just the diet. He's on limited yeah, training now. Yeah, he's, he's slimmed down a little bit. He's not Too so nightery is, mate. It's yeah, mad to think someone... Like that. Um, he needed to be to play that position and also for his fitness. Because, hey, touch wood, you know, he, he picked up, he's picked up a lot of injuries as well. And at the moment, so far, so good. I'm not going to say it, but, you know, long may it continue. And he's our top scorer in the Premier League. So, yeah. you know, we, we <laughs> it's got to be, for me, one of the better ones. Yeah, no, absolutely, mate. So, obviously, sorry, I, my, my maths was terrible. So, he's averaging a goal roughly one in three and yeah. an assist one in four. That's flipping great going, That's isn't it? That's very good, yeah. That's very... For a um, guy that's converted a right back. Yeah, so, obviously, when we first signed him, I know this is talking about centre-forwards, um, I, w- I was very frustrated to start off with the fact that he wasn't really in the team. He didn't really come in until like late November, early December. I remember him getting that flute goal, the Southampton yeah. one, when it come off his head off or his leg, yeah. uh, uh, and went in. Um, but no, he's he's an amazing player and a servant for the club. He he deserves his contract, and I've, yeah. I've got a lot of respect for him even more. The fact that he does want uh, strikers to come in for more competition, so I've got a huge respect for him there. Um, 
let's have a look who's in the chat. Evening, Tom. Tom, Evening, Tom. Uh, this is the, uh, if you've not seen him, got a Mark Cantonio out of 10 and your reasons why, if you would. Wow, what's that? A thousand out of 10. Wow. That's the highest we've got so far, mate. Definitely. Uh, definitely the highest. Kent, Kent's with the comment, nine. Play anywhere, but can't shoot from outside the box. He came from Forest. He couldn't get a game. He played at right back. Just wasn't the same. Yeah. Yeah. Kent's, good show. Kent's. Mr. Cox is in the building. Hope you're doing well. Rich. Yeah. So what's your rating, Mike? What would you yeah, give him? Yeah, I'm going to give him a nine as well, mate. I mean, yeah. let's face it. I mean, for a guy who's out there playing a low <laughs> furrow all the time, you know, um, mm. we absolutely rely on him. And... Um, yeah, fair shout. What his comments the other day about we should sign a striker because I want the competition. So you can't knock the guy for that. And I mean, that record's pretty damn good for me. Yeah, no, definitely. Tom, Mickey gets a nine from me. Yeah. Oh, half mark. 9.5. Do mm. we give half marks, Mike? We don't normally, but as we'll it's we've got to lay yeah. down. <laughs> yeah, we'll make an exception for that one. Okay, exception for mum. Yeah, and not, and a nine from Mr. Cox. Yeah. Right, we've had a we've had a we've gone up, we've gone down, we've gone up, we've gone <laughs> We're down. We're going back and, down again, aren't we? Of course we are, mate. It's like it's like, a, it's like Are you ready for this one? Go on. Oh. An MEK. <laughs> yeah. Well, I do remember one of the goals he scored. It was it against? Was it Blackburn in the cup? Scored um, two at Blackburn. Two at Blackburn, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was it then, wasn't it? That Blackburn game, that was it. He's peaked there, hasn't he? And that yeah. was it. Um, <laughs> what, do you, what do you want to say, mate? Oh, what, what can you say, really? <laughs> I mean, it was, it, that was it. He peaked then and uh, just didn't show anything after that. Do you know I mean, what? When we, we've had when, worse. That's all I can say. When we when we first signed him, I was like, we've actually got another decent striker who yeah. can who can really like push on, and uh, but it just didn't work out. I mean, I can't remember what game it was. There was one game in particular in the Premier League. He uh, he played and he was absolutely woeful. woeful. I think we had yeah. really woeful. But uh, let's have a look here. Oh, um, you get a five from four, oh yeah from Sat. Yeah, if we were rating on that, Kent, I think even a five is very nice. Bless him. But, yeah. Um, I can't believe he's playing three games for Jamaica in a week. It's ridiculous, isn't it? It's ridiculous. No. Um, <laughs> Kent must have known. Look, sorry, this was before it came out. I saw that. Is it? Look, is it on the is list? It? And, and literally, it was <laughs> the next one. He was waiting for him. Tom, please tell me you're joking. A 10 for this lad. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, he's born to wind up. Four for Uncle Enemike from Kent. Crap yeah. player again. I'm loving these guys. <laughs> oh, I'm, going, I'm going with a four because if you look at 16 and two goals, I mean, you mm. know, rating up against some of the other we've had, yeah, I've got to give him four. Yeah. To be Mr. Cox, Mr. Mr. Cox has been Yeah, Rich four. agrees with me, yeah. Tom, it'd be a five for me, but 10 out of 10 for dating Miss Nigeria. Nigeria. 16 and 27. Fair shake, mate. Oh. Neil from Down Under. Neil, if you haven't watched this show, mate, Neil. get involved as well. Um, it's um, give the ratings out of 10 and we talk about the memories of the fantastic five strikers what David Gold and Sullivan have bought. And f- well done, Neil. I've only got one 5.45 in my day. <laughs> and look, he's back in the building, Jake from West Ham Unofficial. Everyone's yeah. saying hello to each other. Right. Do you reckon it can get better, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Go on, I know what you're going to splash at me now. I Ready? know what it's going to be. Go on. Tony Martinez. Oh, oh. There you, yeah. I mean, this guy Yeah. did it in the under 23s, didn't he? That's why I, mean, I thought I had to put it on there, mate. Obviously, we signed yeah. him for £2.4 million. Pound. Under yeah. 23 appearances, he made um, 29 appearances, 25 goals and 5 assists for the under 23s. Obviously, made three appearances appearances for um for the first team but he's smashing it for well not i wouldn't say smashing it obviously he got his move to porto after scoring some goals around um high expectations on him mate really wasn't it they thought he was going to be the next best thing yeah i think it, it was too much for him really uh, good on him for going over there and he's doing okay i've seen a couple of goals that he scored to be fair um with that sort of record in the end of 23s you think 
he would have given it a better crack, really. Yeah. You know, he's, he's only got three appearances, to be fair to him. So, you know, they yeah. must have looked at him and thought, no, nah, he's just never going to do it in the Premier League. And they've let yeah. him go. Yeah. Everyone's saying hello. I'll, <laughs> uh, I'll try to keep that quiet. Did, did, did Richard, have you spoke to Rich? Uh, I've heard all nah. about this, mate. Yeah. Uh, oh, don't. Um, yeah, you've got to have don't. a permit to film here. Did you see it? I don't know on West Ham on Marsh's video. You see me and Dom, and then there's another video when he goes. Uh, and I, I, it was quite funny actually. Um, I went up to this this other steward come up to me, and when um, you can't do it, I went sue me, and then he walked away. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Sorry, I've missed a few comments. Uh, let's have a look. Oh. Everyone's saying hello to each other. It'll be a short show then, Andy. Uh, Andrew, hope you're doing well, mate. Uh, let's have a look here. Oh, everyone's saying hello. Not bad under 23 stats. Kent, two for Martinez. Couldn't cut. Watched him versus Strobe in the cup. He was all, yeah. all, awful. Re Reese Burke scored. Oh, I remember that. Yeah, yeah. He was <laughs> yeah. poor that night. <laughs> yeah, quote from the week. Yeah, and I'm, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure... Uh, Jake heard a bit of foul language from, from, from me as well that day towards him. <laughs> but it had to be done. Let's have a look here. <laughs> Uh, uh, invisible, yeah. Uh, let's have a look here. Yeah, it, it could have been more two or three, I'm afraid. Never played, scored for us. Didn't know we paid 2.5 million. Ryan yeah. saying, Yeah, Ryan said, Yeah, that was it. Rich. I like the day I only said, Sue us, Ryan, we ain't got no money. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so really, really, really we got, yeah, yeah. right. So Kent's gone in with a two. For this, Mike, what are you going to yeah, give Tony I Martinez? Mean, three appearances, so it's difficult. You know, I'm going to give him a three because, you know, his record in the under 23s is pretty good. Three appearances, you know, I mean, even, you know, we've had a lot of players who've not cracked it in the first three appearances, haven't we, over yeah. the years? So maybe a little oh, bit. Oh, we've, we've got some coming up, mate. <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. I'm ready for it. <laughs> yeah. So that's a two. We've got a one here. I'm going to give him a two as well. I'm going to give him a two. Right, you ready for the next one, Mike? It's getting yeah. better, mate. It's getting cool. better. Next one is Ashley Fletcher. Ashley Fletcher, yeah. Disappointed yeah. me, this one, mate. Really did. Yeah. Especially yeah. buying him from where we bought him from. Yeah. You know, I, I know they've let him go, but they've let some good strikers go over the years. I mean, I did. I was hoping for more from this guy. Yeah. He always threatened. You know, when he was on the pitch, he looked like he was going to do something. He put himself around, but he just won up to it. Is he still playing championship football now, I think? No, he plays for Watford now. Oh, Watford, is it? Yeah, he, he, he signed for them on a free in the summer, but he was at Middlesbrough. I think Middlesbrough, think Middlesbrough paid about £10 million pound for him, I think, Did they, from really? us. I think it was about that high, or that was including add-ons. But yeah, like yeah. A, few, a few people said, uh, 20 appearances, one goal. Um, let's have a look here. Uh, five. I'm guessing that was for thingy one. Yeah. Uh, uh, four for the goal at, at United. Obviously, got that in the yeah. cup. Yeah. Um, that's a good question, Mike. Did he yeah. get enough chances? Really? Rich might. He, he could be right there, but I mean, he, he had 20 appearances. Um. Yeah. You know, I mean, if we're going back to Martinez when he only had three, you know. 20, 20 appearances is enough, you know, to to show what you can do. Okay, a lot of them, I presume, came off the bench, yeah? Yeah. Um, so then it's a bit harsh if he's only come on for 20 minutes here and there, or maybe even less. Yeah. But he didn't, really, he didn't really cut it in the championship either, to be honest. No, he I think, didn't. I think no. he scored a couple for Watford this season, but I think that's been in the was in the Carabao Cup, I think. Yeah. So he's not yeah. he's not like we can't get in the, the side at the minute, so obviously he isn't. Um forgotten player. I'll Jake, stop it. Andy and Mike Lenendry combo. I'll stop it. <laughs> stop it. Jake. Uh, Kent Hammers, he was rated better than Rashford reportedly at the time. Five for his only goal was at Old Trafford. Yeah. I'll give him four for that. For that go, <laughs> shit player, love it. Just straight to the point. No, no even explanation. Just shit, love it. Uh, evening, Bobby. Hope you're doing well, mate. Um, I won't see you now for a while in the refreshments. Will I? When's the next? 
Newcastle. No, Watford's our next home game, so I'll probably see you there. Uh, right? Watford, yeah. Yeah, and uh, evening, guys. Hope you're doing well, Grant. Right, do you reckon it can get better, Mike? Come on, it's got to. <laughs> Zaza. <laughs> Mate. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, another guy who went off and did well elsewhere. But do you know the best bit? So everyone, before you get to... Simone Zaza joined us on August 2016. £5 million pound loan fee. And left the club in January 2017. But Mike, the floor is yours. Oh, mate. I mean, this guy just... Oh, I remember... Did he play in the Astra game? Did he? I was there and, oh, God, it was awful. I mean, terrible. Well, he played, well, he scored a goal against us because he played for Juventus that day. Yeah, he, scored the he goal. did. I remember that. He came back and scored against us. But, I mean, the chances this guy missed. Oh, my God. <laughs> Put on a plate as well, right in front of the goal on, on occasions. Oh, no, no. It was just never going to happen for him, was it? Yeah. No. He, he, I'm, I'm, just... he, he gets two for putting the shirt on and having a couple of shots that, you know, do you think somewhere behind the because goal. of the fee what we've played? I know we're going to get on to some other players, but do you think that's one of the worst signings ever? I know we've had some it's, crap before. It's, it's a poor, but it's, poor, it's because poor of the fee, I think, that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, no, I, I, I take, I'm giving him one. That's that, that's it, maturing it up, full stop. Straight, Mr. Cox has gone in for one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, Hammerhead, I love your kind. Jake's <laughs> gone for a zero. A zero. Shy. Shy. Zaza hop, skip, <laughs> and jump. Dog shit. Minus two. Minus oh. two. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, we're going to take cool. minuses, Andrew, as well. I can see your comment below as well. We do take yeah. minuses. His head's, oh, his head's upside down. His head's upside down. Nice oh. one. Uh, zero, worst player. And yeah, do you take minuses? Yeah, we do. I can't remember what game it was. I think it was a couple of games when we actually played well and we won. And he was like celebrating like it was like all about him as well. I remember a couple oh, of yeah, old celebrations. Yeah. <laughs> and then and he he's scored. Done, he's done nothing. No assists, no goals, 11 appearances. It's bad, and isn't it? And most money. of them were starts, I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember him starting on a few occasions. Yeah. Right. Mike, do you reckon this is going to get better? Do you think mm. this is getting better? <laughs> Got to. Next one. Ah, oh, this is the worst shot. I've seen him have the worst shot ever, this guy. <laughs> Remember, <laughs> was it against Man United? He was in, the ball bounced to him somewhere around the 18-yard box, Kent to tell us. Um, he had a shot, and I mean, it went out for a throw-in, right? But it didn't go out for a throw-in in the corner it went out for a throw in halfway Behind it. down the halfway line i mean it's got to be the worst shot i've ever seen from a professional footballer in my life full stop i remember if kemp correct me if i'm wrong God. i remember i think his one goal was middlesbrough away i think and i think it's yeah, a deflection yeah. yeah 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 i think i remember that one as well yeah another poor one mate i'm afraid this he, he was on loan, yeah, that's right. Yeah, oh god, he missed so many chances as well. I mean, if so, if you had a collection of the chances he missed, oh, it'd be. Oh, it was so high, high expectations high. on him, though, weren't there? There was oh, such yeah. high, there was yeah. such high expectations for him. Let's have a look here. Minus six. I think that was for Zaza. Mister Cox is coming for two. Uh, Hammerhead didn't even know he scored for us. Even the <laughs> oh Neil, that's good. for early in the morning. That's a good one. I've got a story about Galeri costing a West Ham fan two hundred and fifty. Oh Kent, you've got to tell us. You've got to two hundred and fifty grand. I bet it was like Galeri to score uh, to score or something, and he missed oh, or whatever. Yeah, I've got to wait for that story. Uh, it's probably look. the goal we scored. <laughs> <laughs> I love <it>. and again. <laughs> Blair and Mamet. Oh, he's every single one of them is pretty much. It's, it doesn't get better. At, like I think we've got one more after this, but the next show it doesn't even get much better. To right, be I mean, it, yeah. I... Someone to tell me who that shot was against, and if they remember it, but it was no. most awful ref, ref, I've ever seen. Andrew's not even given a rating that reference previous no. comment. 
Jonathan Calamari. Calamari. Right, right. Um, do you have an idea, Mike? So this is like the last... We signed this player in the January, and a few people might say, well, we didn't really play as a striker. Uh, we paid £20 million for him. Do you have an idea who it is? And he wasn't the striker? Well, he played on the wing as well. Oh, from Wales. Hit. We signed him from Wales. Um, not, um, we signed him from Cardiff. Swansea. Swansea. Oh, you're on about, um, are you? Yeah. Are you? Well, I've got to say, I, you know, I thought, we, <laughs> I thought he was okay, to be honest. Oh, sorry. Sorry. One second. Uh, Kent Caleri, one goal cost a West Ham fan 250k. Super six jackpot scored the third from a deflection, which the bloke had 2 1. No, 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 that's mad. Oh dear, oh dear, no, <sighs> that's got a right, isn't it? That's awful, that isn't it? 250k. <sighs> So there we go, Mike. As you can see, as you can see there, we signed him in August 2016 for 20.5 million. Um, do you reckon he was weren't given much time or the system? I, I thought he he was okay for us. I he did, wasn't I, outstanding, I, but I rated him honestly. I thought he was a decent striker. Um, he didn't do enough, did he? Really? But 12 goals and 50 appearances is not abysmal. Mm. It's not abysmal, but. I think, you know, he, he was good at Swansea. He scored hatfuls of goals at Swansea. He went back there again, didn't he, I think? But joking aside, um, he's by far the worst. And, you know, I, I remember a couple of goals that he scored. You know, he crashed them in. I mean, the, he did know where the back of the net was. But like you say, he cut in from the wing a bit more than playing as a central striker. Yeah, no, he played well. I remember... Um... Obviously, Tottenham when we won one 0 this season yeah. at home, uh, uh, yeah. at home, and Tottenham away in the cup. Drembury scored one and oh. set up one, didn't he? When he we did, won three yeah. two, the three two game when we was losing yeah. two 0 Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, so yeah, he, he gets a decent did, rating. He, he, he looked a bit lazy sometimes for me, though. Yeah, probably, probably he's he had some ability. There's no doubt about it. You know and. Like I say, twelve goals from fifty appearances is is not abysmal. Yeah, he probably he gets a good mark from me. I'll I'll give him seven. Absolute snake, love it. Richard's going for a five. Uh, Andrew's going for ten for his two goals against Spurs. Um, I gave a hundred percent too lightweight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think he just didn't yeah. have. To, if it was just a couple of yards quicker. I think yeah. he would have been decent for us because he sort of plays that bone role for us now, yeah, doesn't he, does, he? Really. Yeah. He wasn't yeah. quite quick enough, though. Yeah, you're right, and uh, strong the enough. The bloke was on soccer. Oh, the bloke was on soccer and next week. Fair play to him for going on. Yeah, yeah. Mandy's giving him a five. Kent's giving him a six. And uh, Hammerhead, Jordan Hayu, his brother pisses me oh, off. Oh, he, he plays scored for. that worldie against us, doesn't he? Yeah. He always scores against us, though, mate, doesn't he? God, he skipped by everyone, didn't he? Oh God, someone should yeah. have flattened him. Yeah, oh. uh, definitely. So, Mike, if you had to rate, obviously we had some... Oh, yeah. let's go through. So, we had nine players there. So, we had Andre Ayew, Jonathan Caleri, Simone Zaza, Ashley Fletcher, Tony Martinez, Enemike, Mikel Antonio, Luka Belic, Nikola Jelovic. If you had to rate all them out of 10 as a combined, what would you give them? Cool. <laughs> well, all of them other than Antonio, I'll give them about seven. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean they rate from naught going up to then you got I've rated Antonio at nine. I mean the rest of them put together lucky to get nine. Yeah, but, I know. Uh, I know. Yeah, say no more. Although you know, are you a you know a six or a seven for him, fair dues? But yeah. you yeah. know the rest. Mm. Yeah. Terrible. Happy. Uh, happy. Uh, happy. Happy. in the building. Hope you're doing okay. Twelve goals and fifty appearances is not bad. Yeah. Uh, six or seven for all of them together. And yeah. they're six purely because uh, of Antonio. Right, yeah. people. So I'm not going to spoil it too much. We have got another snake, so, uh, which is um, Marco Anatovic. 
We've got Sebastian Haller coming up, and we've got a couple of other strikers who have appeared. So uh, it may be one more show, and it may be two. I need to work out roughly how many of 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 we got left because I don't like to. Um, Oh, Mandu, yeah, we did rate Zaza. Sorry, we've been in order. You might be a bit late. You might have to watch. Uh, you can more than welcome to put your ratings in the comments if we finish uh, before them. Let's have a look at any more. I was, was like I was yeah. promising, but never quite. Agree, delivered. yeah. Mike, I bet you can't wait for the next lot, can you? The, the, the next lot. This... Oh, we're going to have some more beauties, mate, aren't we? We're yeah, going to have some more beauties. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, definitely. I'd like to thank everyone in the chat again, as always. Like you said, these shows are not the same without anyone in the chat uh, talking about their memories. But I, I think... Um, oh, let's have a look here. <laughs> Needs a show to, all to himself. <laughs> might have to. It's, might have to. It's have not to. all about me, honestly. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> or should we just do one for his brother? Brother and aunt. But split yeah, into yeah, two, yeah. maybe. Yeah, he deserves one, all right. Yeah. No. Um, <laughs> Like I said, we're not playing a game, but we might do it next next Monday again, probably. Like maybe a little bit later, like half seven ish, because there's no football on, is there? So we yeah. might come back and do that the last one. I I'll tell you what we'll do, Mike. Even if there's like twelve, because it's roughly like nine, we'll just finish it, finish them off next week. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just finish go, them off. Yeah, we'll, we'll peel them we'll, off. We'll, we'll yeah. them off. And <laughs> as I said, thanks to everyone in the chat. It's been an absolute pleasure, Mike. As always, giving his expert opinions, Ken. Grant, everyone who follows us. And if you are new around here, um, well, I say we've reached another 790 subscribers we're at at the minute now. So we're slowly uh, so, slowly going back up again. So recommend it to your friends. Like you said, it's not too serious on this show. And if you've got any ideas what you want us to do, um, let us know. Let's have a look. Kent. He, he's classed as a striker, Kent, because he played one game. There, so he is on the next one. See, Kent's ready. Kent's ready. He's, he's up for it. Kent's yeah, up for it. And uh, Andrew Fielding, with all West Ham crap strikers, you'll need six hours. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Mandy, Mandy, saying, "Come on, you minds." And but yeah, take care, everyone. Take take care, Bobby. Like I said, we'll put, we'll do it a little bit later next week. Half seven next week. Me and Mike will be back for another episode. Hope you enjoy your week. Because you know what, I'm gonna have a rest this week unless a transfer happens. I don't oh. think I'm gonna. Be, uh, oh. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be back. A Jesse Lingard, a Jesse Lingard. <laughs> Unless Jesse Lingard signs. Oh no! I've just remembered, Mike. We won't. We can't do it next thing, eh? It's deadline day. It's deadline next, day. Deadline day next month. We we'll have to. We'll, pay, we'll we'll have a chat. But you, yeah. if you subscribe to us, you'll be able to see we'll all of. Yeah. We'll work yeah. it out. But, like and subscribe, everyone. And hit ding that bell. Yeah, yeah. Like, subscribe, and ding the bell. You have to watch it back. You have to watch it back. Happy. <laughs> <laughs> but no, thanks to everyone. And yeah, I'll be back unless another transfer happens. And we'll be back for the last show. And obviously, transfer deadline day next Monday. So, really looking forward to that. And one thing left to say, Mike, which is come on, you eyes. Come on, you eyes. Take care, everyone. See you later, guys. <laughs>